Once upon a time in a strange land called England, there was a boy named Xenon 4F14 5D6 6S2, commonly called Osmia. He was born in 1803 to Smithson Tennant after being dissolved out of platinum ore alongside his twin brother Iridium. Talk about trial and error. Being element 76, Osmium's isotopic family was large, with dozens of cousins, ranging from Osmium-162 to Osmium-194. However, only six of his relatives were stable. Little Osmium was constantly bullied for being dense. He was denser than any other element, exactly 22.59 grams per cubic centimeter. All the non-metals and other transition metals would never invite him to their lunch table because he smelled awful. It was even in his name, Osmium coming from the Greek root osmi, meaning smell. The actinoids in period 7 elements didn't want to hang out with Osmium either because he wasn't radioactive like them. He unknowingly harmed his father's scientist friends too. The Osmium tetroxide that he formed caused people of the time many lung and eye problems. All of the bullying and rough past made Osmium very angry. Unable to withstand any more maltreatment at school, Osmium took to the gym for the summer. He worked and worked and worked, getting himself stronger and stronger and stronger. He eventually grew big and buff, almost surpassing diamond in strength and retaining the fourth highest melting point of any element. After a long summer grind, it was finally time for Osmium to get back at his haters. Osmium returned to school in the fall, shocking all the elements. His bluish-white, lustrous aura radiated like never before. His muscles were hard and brittle. He even got job offers from many other fields. These included working with pen nibs, needles, surgical and lab equipment, electrical circuits, alloys, and even dating old meteors. Osmium would go on to advance humanity with its role in early light bulbs as a filament. Osmium ultimately helped scientists understand the extreme capabilities of dense metals while remaining a highly coveted element, naturally occurring at around only 50 parts per trillion. Ultimately, Osmium lived happily ever after. The End